Today we're here at Infocom 2011, standing in front of a projection mapping display that uses a portrait roadie 35K flanked by two portrait HD 18K projectors to show this novel projection mapping display. Projection mapping has been around for, for a long time, longer than people uh, expect. Originally used with um, slide projectors um, to project images onto to buildings and, and different facades. But the technology um, that now enables projectors to be used in these kind of things didn't really come to be until the last uh, decade or so when companies like Christie um, helped really develop these twist boards that can then take a digital display and map it and warp it and contour it to match surfaces onto these buildings or, or various facades. It's interesting to see how this technology has evolved and where it's being used today. In fact, we're now starting to see it used not just in architectural mappings, but also in product launches and very, very creative situations. You know, we're seeing the technology now more away from just a, a, a form of showing digital media and into more of an art and exhibition kind of format. So we're very excited to have been there as this technology has evolved, as these uh, marriage of different talents uh, come together to produce these types of effects. Talents like creative directors, lighting directors, projectionists, and a really creative community that comes together to pull these things off. We have collaborated with Christy on this project and after the first meeting I realized that you know what uh, Christy would like to show is all this versatility, you know, different flavors of uh, different ways we can we can transform the, the facade. So uh, I invited to uh, I invited a group of artists to work on this project from around the world. You know, we uh, we have worked with an artist from Japan, from France, from Italy, one from Canada, one from the States, and one from Poland. So it is uh, really an international effort. When I started doing this work. Uh, it took, it took weeks, you know, it took days and weeks and months sometimes to develop a project because we had to do a lot of planning, you know, we had to photograph the buildings from the same point of uh, where we were setting up the projectors. You know, ev everything had to be like really exact, but today, you know, we can, we can work off the pictures and then we can work, work the images using digital technology. So the one thing that I really like about Christy is that, you know, Christy makes a 35K projector, you know, which is really bright and gets to a point where, you know, we can can really make uh, you know bright, colorful images, you know, the facades of the buildings, which just a few years ago it was was really hard to do and almost impossible.